Okay, for top secret, we're gonna do breaking news. This cam, this uh, Python camera, and then we're gonna talk about this RTK thing, and then I'm gonna show you a preview of a logo we're thinking of. Don't worry, we're not changing our logo to X. All right, Lady Ada, what's this? This is me bringing up the Pi Camera S3. This is an ESP32 uh, S3 now based camera board. You can see us in the viewfinder. It's got a wide angle camera, SD card, some ports, and some QT for expansion and battery stuff. I gotta get this working. Reset button, on off switch, and a little viewfinder. So I can, uh, oh, and then on the back, I've got um, a beeper and some um, control, um, X, you know, up, down, left, right buttons. A little microphone that I haven't hooked up yet, but I thought it could be kind of fun. And then, you know, just testing out taking photos and saving them. You can see here, I've got a UI to change the resolution. So if I want to um, take some bigger high res images, I can do that. Wow, to 1920. So this is the OV5640. So far, so good. Coming soon. All right, so this is the board. Um, we're going to put that video up on the socials later. Yeah, this was a little bit of a close up we did. So uh, this is a uh, way early coming soon, but it's a uh, yes. Yeah, so this was an S two, but we are we, you know that we can well for reasons we had to revise it to do the S three, um, but now we're we're back on track. So uh, yeah, we wanted to, we always wanted to have a little camera that was programmable with Python. Fully, this might be the only fully open source uh, camera. Yes. Um, so yeah, the ESP32 S3 with plenty of flash and RAM, and then this OB5640, nice quality camera, and then TFT display, and you saw some buttons and the piezo, and uh, we also have a battery. I got to get the battery uh, stuff working next. Yeah. Um, and then we have an RTK board. Yeah, I mean, this is a this is from years ago, this is like 2020, um, but, you know, we, I couldn't get RTK modules, and now they're available again. So um, I've ordered this RTK shield. Uh, that I'll probably plug on top of the Metro ESP32 S3 um, to act as the uh, Wi-Fi uh, transport for the signal that comes from the RTK. You have to um, send the signal from the base station to the module and back to be able to calculate your exact location. Um, we also have a logo. Forget about this. Yes. So I was looking at this. It looks like pinpoint or pin paint but it, it's supposed to be pinpoint feather pinpoint because it's like it's a it's a pinpoint yeah so uh we might go with that uh we'll see but that would be for this series all the rtk boards because like what is our like no one knows what that because what are, rtk real-time yeah. kinematics well, that so, really because you use it to pinpoint things yes. um and that's top secret this week